A kitty decides, election did not live up to global standards, say U.S. observer group. Others a coalition of domestic and international election observers accredited to observe the July 14 governorship poll in a kitty state said the election fell short of global best practices in electoral standards. The Independent National Electoral Commission declared the candidate of the All Progressives Congress, Kuyade Fiemi, as the winner of the election. The observers, who comprise representatives from over 50 domestic organizations, human rights groups and international election observer bodies, base their report on lapses noticed in the conduct of the election, especially the role of security agencies. The observers include Center for Credible Leadership and Citizens Awareness, Nigeria, Justice and Equity Organization, Nigeria, International Republican Institute, United States of America, and Patriotic Women Foundation, Abuja, as well as the other bodies from the African unions, among others. The observers, who praised INEC for the proper conduct of the poll in line with global and constitutional dictates and standards, faltered the deployment of 30,000 policemen for the election. The observers stated that the conduct of some of the security operatives and unwholesome practices of vote buying, where voters surreptitiously showed which party they voted to party agents who went behind to settle them, largely marred the electoral process. They also said the election was characterized by ballot box snatching, sporadic shootings and driving away of some party agents as well as intimidation, oppression, and forceful influence of electorate's free will, among others. The observers, therefore, held that the July 14 poll could not be recommended as a template for the forthcoming 2019 general elections as it fell short of global standards and spelt doom. Addressing newsmen on behalf of the domestic observers, Gabriel N. W. Ambu, of the Center for Credible Leadership and Citizens' Awareness, Abuja, said, the exercise witnessed a high level of unprecedented electoral-related challenges and such. Abuse will remain contentious until justice prevails, especially in the areas of cash inducement, arrests of political stalwarts by security agents and snatching of electoral materials by political thugs, among other abuses. Party agents had huge cash and were close to voting points. Security agents were indifferent to cash inducement of voters. The whole process falls short of the compliance with international best standards. One of the international observers, Mrs. Virginia Marimur GAE, of the URI, USA, said trouble began at 11 a.m. when C and by started and this caused chaos across all the wards and polling units. Voters showed their ballot papers to party agents to collect money, thugs disrupted the voting process by shooting, but the police and other attaching security agents did well by establishing their presence at the polling units as stipulated by the Constitution. We also noted that the INEC has improved on card readers this time, she submitted. Think your friend would be INTRESTED? Share this story using any of the share button below down arrow place your text advert below greater than 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 loading. Share your story with us via email, info at 247nigerianewsupdate.co Receive news via our WhatsApp, kindly text 234,701056-03942 Add you, click here, to join us on our YouTube channel for news update Click here, to join us on Twitter for instant news update, at 247NGNEWSUPDAT. Click here to join millions around the globe to read news on our Facebook fan page for instant updates on Instagram. Click here receive instant news update via our BBM broadcast, D3DEFDF.